The Eastern Corridor Project embodies all aspects of a truly transformational regional multimodal transportation project. In short, the Eastern Corridor will provide the only substantial east-west connection for much of the region. The Eastern Corridor projects include new transit options, walking trails, road improvements, and rail inclusion that are comprehensive in structure and will unlock a variety of benefits. These benefits include cleaner air, saving millions of gallons of gasoline, and millions of hours of commuter time, economic development of our region's eastern edge, and safety for many of our two million citizens. The various Eastern Corridor projects work together and integrate future land use with transportation planning and development. The project is of a massive scope, as it incorporates nearly 200 square miles in Ohio's eastern Hamilton County, western Claremont County, and portions of northern Kentucky. The Eastern Corridor projects are key in improving OKI's regional transportation network and ensuring the continued economic viability of scores of communities in the OKI region. The advantages and benefits of the Eastern Corridor have been known for almost 20 years. However, consideration is seldom given to what the impact on the region would be if the Eastern Corridor is not built. In no uncertain terms, the impact is debilitating as it throws much of the region into gridlock. The video uses forecasted travel time between 2013 and 2040 during evening rush hour. It illustrates what happens to traffic volumes if we don't complete the Eastern Corridor projects. As the years progress, the green lines, which is essentially free flow traffic, turn different colors representing how congestion grows until it is gridlocked as shown by the red lines. This illustration demonstrates what happens to the traffic flow through the OKI region if the Eastern Corridor projects are not built. The negative effect of congestion is dramatic. Travel time from the downtown Cincinnati Business District to Newtown swells from 41 minutes in 2013 to more than an hour and a half in 2040 for that 11 mile trip. Delays between the Central Business District and Eastgate using US Route 50 and State Route 32 increased from 53 minutes in 2013 to two hours in 2040 for the 16 mile trip. The 18 mile trip using Interstates 471 and 275 to travel from the Central Business District to Eastgate also increases from the current 41 minutes to more than an hour and a half in 2040. It is imperative that the Eastern Corridor projects be built to offset the impending traffic gridlock and lack of efficient freight movement within the OKI region in order for this region to remain economically competitive. The Eastern Corridor projects are crucial for this region to attack its mobility and infrastructure problems in transportation, economic development, and quality of life terms. Failure to act after 20 years of work and investment would be the height of governmental inefficiency and continue to negatively impact the environment, economic development, and safety for all who live in and use the Eastern Corridor.